Now, it could be easily the biggest land scam of all hundreds of thousands of acres of land given to Dalits under the Panchami scheme have been grabbed by other dominant communities over the last several decades. With the Tamil Nadu government now taking action, a committee has been formed to recommend measures to restore them to Dalits. Sam Daniel reports. Pachayamal's family has been fighting in court for what has been their land for two generations. They received the two-acre plot from the government back in 1882 under the Panchami scheme. A scheme the British-ruled Madras presidency had brought in to empower scheduled caste landless farmers. Some years ago, it was forcibly taken over by a rich landlord who claims their dead parents owed him money. <laughs> Veluswami's father had sold the family's Panchami land. As per law, Panchami lands cannot be sold or transferred. They have to stay with the Dalit families they were assigned to, to guard them against poverty. Veluswami has now retrieved it in a long and arduous court battle. <laughs> A result of thousands of such illegal encroachments and sales. Of the 20 lakh acres given to Tamil Nadu's Dalits under the Panchami scheme, only around 1 lakh acres remain with them. For years, Dalit activists have been asking the government to intervene in the recovery. Now, given it's an election year, the Tamil Nadu government has suddenly woken up to the issue and announced a committee that will recommend how to restore the plots to original owners. For the past 80, 90 years, these Dalits, though, although they have been given lands, they have been deprived of these lands, and this has been a very much big hurdle in their development. The lack of political will has meant land ownership among Dalits in Tamil Nadu on the ground has not improved in a whole century. In Madurai with camera person Chandran, Sam Daniel, Find the TV.